Hey there Dark and Darker fans, and welcome to episode 4 of our Community Feedback Summary series. Despite this week being fairly quiet from both the community perspective and the developer perspective, there was only one hotfix instead of two, we end this week with some of the largest news since the announcement of Early Access. However, before we get into that, let's quickly cover the latest community feedback and responses and see how Iron Mace reacted. After we cover a topic, remember to leave me your thoughts in the comments. Your feedback helps me keep these topics relevant and gives me a better feel for what the community is thinking. Prior to this week's feedback and changes, rogues didn't seem to be on the community's radar, at least no more than any other topic. However, once Spud Hunter posted his video voicing his complaints about the rogues' power levels, there seemed to be some agreement that rogues were capable of too much uncounterable burst damage. That said, unless Spud knew something we didn't, I think no one was counting on the basket of nerfs which hit rogue during hotfix number 13. I talk about these changes at length in a dedicated video, so go check that out if you're looking for that conversation. The community feedback has been predictable, yet surprising. Players who don't play Rogue like the nerf and are celebrating the changes, predictable, while Rogue players are not actually complaining too much, surprising. Most players seem to agree that the changes are okay, if a little heavy-handed. However, Iron Mace has assured their player base that the heavy nerfs are required and are in line with the goals of their upcoming Early Access patch. Speaking of the Early Access patch, this segues nicely into our next community-founded topic. This week's top post focused on the community's desire for a new wipe. From a community perspective, there have been numerous changes lately and I think players wouldn't mind a restart with all the new content in place. Additionally, a wipe tends to reinvigorate the community and gets all the players back who had perhaps tired of the game. Consecutive player count has been dropping of late. On this topic, it seems as if the community and Iron Mace were of one mind. The developers have officially announced that Early Access Wipe number 2 will commence on Tuesday, September 26. Early Access Patch number 1 will be included with the wipe and introduce sweeping balance changes that will affect almost every class, weapon, and item in the game. Balance and or gear adjustments have been coming for quite some time now, However, usually only one class or one type of gear or attribute gets changed at a time. This time, however, Iron Mace is telling us that almost all classes and gear are seeing changes. That's actually pretty insane. This amount of change will definitely upset what we know of the game and how we play it, though we haven't seen any actual notes on the changes yet. Changes like this can be good in that they excite the community and generate a lot of hype, Although, changes like this can also be risky, as some players don't like to see their beloved game change. That said, we're in early access, so we all accept that nothing is written in stone. Additionally, Iron Mace has a very good record of listening to their community feedback and responding quickly. So overall, I'm looking forward to whatever it is that is coming, and I think most of the community shares that mindset. And that's it for now. Thanks for any comments, likes, and subscriptions. I appreciate your engagement. See you in the dungeon!